now we are ready to go to the data tab so here is the most important this is the most important part of the of the system um, so once we sell the system for the first time we have this system level the first thing that you need to do is just click here on the context menu and start to see what's uh, going on here inside this menu we have a lot of options but let's say that uh, the first thing that you need to do is to create the structure of your network so we work with this kind of a reseller and a manager um, logic so the first thing that you need to do is just to add the reseller once you add the reseller you have simply come um, fields here that you need to, to fill with just uh, data custom domain here you can also always override the, the logo SL certificate specific SMS gateway so um, and, and general options but the, the thing is that you need to fill here the information of your reseller it could be but most of the time is, is like this that uh, um, the first reseller is your own company so just try to imagine maybe you just download the system you're working with the system for the first time and you want to try a gateway on your own office so you will be the reseller and under your reseller you will put you will put always yourself also as a manager so if you then later we will see uh, much better this but uh, let's say for the for a moment you just click on the reseller you add the reseller so you will be like in this situation in this case we have these six resellers that could be uh, well one i told you one could be your company and one uh, and the other one could be other companies that work for you and that to resell wi-fi but let's say that we are this uh, this first uh, um, this first wi-fi reseller so under this we can always click on the context menu we need to add the manager once we add the manager we have all this um, in this case we have these five managers the, the manager is not a user so sometimes there are um, some 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 of our clients uh, misunderstand the, the concept of the uh, manager it's not a user but it's a different figure inside the system so we have the reseller and the manager so the manager is the final user of the uh, of the gateway so it could be a hotel it could be a restaurant or it could be whatever you want so this is the manager level once we um, add it we have always the same field so we have this general data with some information so we have this kind of category it could be a hotel a beach bus camping or whatever so if you want you can also categorize this it could be useful once we are doing some advertising campaign we can also uh, choose to target the campaign on a specific category but basically what you need to do is just the company name and some information here custom css always privacy policy as a was telling to you before once we were talking about the privacy here you can override the default privacy so here you put the privacy of the hotel or the restaurant or whatever so this is where um, you need to put that information always the version or revision date is available or the specific SMS gateway once you create the manager you are ready to add the gateway and the domain so this is the structure that we have now i will explain to you in detail so we have the reseller we have the manager and then we have the domain the domain is a group of common feature to the gateway so um, for the moment we just click on the context menu and we add the domain the domain is the most important part of the system but we will see this uh, in a few minutes for the moment you just create a domain you set up uh, a name that you want and then you are uh, ready to add the gateway once you add the gateway you, uh, you have almost complete your configuration because it's the gateway um, the gateway page is where you choose the hardware type so here just to give you an idea you choose the hardware that you're going to use so we work with Microtech, Roku, Cisco, Lego, Wave, Cambium and these others so we are always working on implementing this but for the moment these are the gateways that are supported um, well the gateway is the almost the, the final level so here we talk about this you can connect always the access point to the gateway if you want but uh, for the moment we just stop here I just want to show you the gateway gateway information if you work with Microtech you have also these options that are available so you can um, set up the SSID the one port the hotspot port set up VPN so you can also configure the fields and then from the context menu you can download the configuration files so there is also another video that talks about the configuration of the gateway you can take a look at that and you will understand uh, how to configure a gateway properly but now i just want to show you all the structure so um, let me go to another example that maybe it's much more clean and is this so as you can see now we have this 
reseller, with the manager, with the domain, with the gateway. Under the gateway we also add a map, zone or floor. This is one of the latest features that we add that lets you add also the access points. So we enter here on the access points map so you will understand now we have this map that we upload with all the access points that are placed that you can move and you can also simulate the coverage of the single access point. If we go on edit, you can see that we have also the hardware type for the access point and the network settings. Of course, the coverage is just simulated. You know uh, how much it covers inside your own, um, in your, the place where you install that your own area. But uh, um, what I want to show you is just this. So we have this access point that is connected to the gateway. The gateway, as we saw, is where you um, configure the hardware type. So you configure all these uh, settings, of course, but most important, the hardware type and the other, the configuration. And they are always, all the gateways that you have are part of the domain. Now we start to talk about the domain. 